we are going to see about the soil properties prediction for agriculture using machine learning techniques uh, then we are going to see about the overview of our process the main objective of our project is to predict the soil properties as well as we have to recommend the crop based on predicted soil properties using machine learning algorithms information about soil properties helps the farmer to do effective and efficient farming and yield more crops with less usage of resources an attempt has been made in this project to predict the soil properties using machine learning approaches the main properties of soil prediction are calcium phosphorus ph soil organic carbon and sand so there is a need for accurate fertilizer recommendations for the farmer and accurately analyzing soil properties here we can predict the soil properties as well as recommend the crop based on soil properties using machine learning the system is developed the machine learning algorithms such as random forest regression and ridge regression so this is the overview of our process then we are going to see about the flow of our process so this is the flow diagram first we have to take your data set the data set name is soil properties data set the data set was collected from some data set repository like uci github kaggle and so on then we have to implement then we have to select your input data set with the help of pandas package Uh, after that we have to implement the pre processing step so here we have to check any missing values is present in your data set if you have any missing values means we have to replace that missing values by zeros uh, why we are uh, checking missing values for avoid wrong prediction then we have to drop unwanted columns if you have any unnecessary columns in your data set means in priorly we have to drop that unnecessary columns then the pre processed data or carry out to data splitting module here we have to split your whole data set into test and train test is used for prediction and train is used for evaluation with the help of this we have to uh classify your data set so the data splitting perform based on ratio 70 is to 30 or 80 is to 20 so based on this ratio we have to split your data set then the splitted data are carry out to classification module here we have to implement different ml techniques that is the random forest regression and ridge regression so with the help of this algorithm we have to predict the soil properties as well as we have to recommend the crop uh, based on predicted soil properties then we have to estimate some performance metrics like accuracy and then some error values so the error values must be low if your error values is low means uh, your model is efficient then we have to compare the uh, two algorithms which one is efficient so this is the flow of our diagram okay this is the uh, output part that is the demo part uh, output of uh, soil properties prediction uh, we are running our process in spider ide from anaconda navigator this is the first model that is the data selection here we are selected your sample of data Uh, we have selected your input data set with the help of pandas package after that in console uh, we have displayed some sample of data from your data set after that pre processing here we have to check any missing values so here zero indicates there is a no missing values in particular column then data splitting here we have to split your whole data set into test and train so this is the total number of data so after training and testing the data is splitted like this then we are implemented classification algorithm so here we are implemented two different algorithms that is the ridge regression and random forest regression 
so this is the result for ridge and random forest so in regression means uh, we have to estimate some error values the error values must be low so this is the mean square error and root root mean square error values for both algorithms then prediction so here we have to predict the soil properties for some sample of data that is the 10 data after that we have to uh, give some inputs it will be prediction the soil properties then we have to recommend the crop for predicted soil properties then it is the comparison graph for um, both algorithms that is the rich regression and random forest regression so this is the output of our project thank you